So this is the these are the benefits of App Engine. We don't have to worry about infrastructure because Google provides this infrastructure. We don't have to worry about installing and configuring services because they are already installed and already configured. We just need to tap into them and use them. Okay. So here at the top are all of the services that were mentioned in the previous slide. So we have cache, we have our database, we have the search index, we have queues and we have email. And all of these are services, so we don't have to build them. They are all already built. We just need to access them using Google's APIs. And for, for that, we're going to need to download the, the Google Cloud SDK. And we're going to be using the SDK to access all of these ser services. Okay. And so that's why it's very easy to develop an, an app engine, because we can simply focus on our application code. We don't have to focus on, on infrastructure. Also, we don't have to worry about scaling our application because when we get a, a peak of traffic and we get a huge spike of traffic, we're, well, App Engine will automatically scale our service. So if we have only one instance running our, the code of our application and suddenly we get a, a ton of requests because maybe someone famous mentioned our application, maybe we were mentioned on, on TechCrunch, well, App Engine is going to automatically spin up new instances and load our code onto those instances to serve our application. So that's a awesome, awesome feature that App Engine has. And it takes away all of that worrying and, and headaches that we would have otherwise if we were to do all of these operations ourselves. We don't have to worry about databases and sharding and, and replication and all that because App Engine does that automatically. Whenever we save something to our data store, okay, the, the name of the database that App Engine uses is the data store. Whenever we save something to the data store, what's in fact happening behind the scenes is that Google is saving this information across multiple data centers across the world. Okay, so so that's that's a really really nice feature because you know. First of all, we can grab this data from where it's fastest to grab it. And all of this is done by App Engine, by the way. And, and second of all, you know, we don't have to worry about sharding and replicating our database because App Engine does that automatically for us. So, so that's really nice. The fifth point is that when we install Google's SDK, we don't have to really worry about anything else. And we don't have to worry that our code will behave differently on our local computer than it will in production because the SDK takes care of this problem and it makes sure that our application will behave exactly the same way as it will in production. Okay. And our and the nice thing about this SDK is that it doesn't depend on the operating system because it's going to be the same for all operating systems, whether you're a Mac, a Linux or a Windows user. And probably the most important thing, which I already said, is that we are be we are able to focus on our application code. So the 100% of our time is spent on developing our application, which is the most important part when we are developing an application. We don't need to care about infrastructure. All of that takes time, and it just you know takes the focus away from us. So so if we want to develop a remarkable, truly amazing application. We need to spend 100% of our time on the application and not on infrastructure. So that's, for me, the main reason why I love App Engine so much. Okay, so this was a, a brief overview on, on how the web works and how, uh, how App Engine is different to building your application your, yourself from scratch. And so, so in the next section, we will actually go ahead and start playing around with App Engine. We will install the SDK and we, in, in, in five minutes, we will actually create and run an application. Okay. So, so hopefully you'll see by then that it's so easy to get started with App Engine. And the, so throughout the next section, we will be building a guestbook application. Okay. It's going to be a very simple application so that you kind of get the feel of how App Engine works and you learn the most important concept of App Engine, which is handling requests. So you're going to learn that and you're also going to learn how to save things to the data store, so to the database, just to get a feel of how everything works.
And from the third section onwards, we will actually set off to build our recipe search engine with all of these components we're, we're talking about here, okay? So this will be a very fun ride. I hope you stick around and I hope you enjoy it.